Elaine Chuli from the Stony Creek Junior Sabres made it on the roster for Team Canada for the 2012 IIHF Women's World Under-18 Hockey Championship. Chuli put in a shutout performance in gold during the semifinal game, and Team Canada went on to defeat the USA in the gold medal game 3-0. In the final game of the season at the historic Ivorwind Stadium, the Ticats defeated the Winnipeg Blue Bombers 28-18. Henry Burris threw for 171 yards and two touchdowns on that rainy day in the hammer. Chris Williams and Andy Fantuz had touchdown receptions, and Avon Coburn led rushing with 13 rushes for 44 yards. Hamilton would, however, lose their next game in Toronto by a field goal to finish 6-12 on the season and miss the playoffs. The Hamilton Bengals Junior C Lacrosse squad finished the season with a 10-5-1 record. Hamilton swept the Furnace Thistles 3-0 in Western semifinals, and then also swept the Halton Hills Bulldogs three games to none in the Western finals to become the West Division champions. The Bengals finished the championship final round with a 1-2 record, but didn't qualify for the championship game. The Glenbrook Rangers finished the regular season in second place with a 26-7-3 record but only faltered in the last few games of the season, dropping five of their final seven games. Glenbrook defeated Caledonia 4-1 in the Eastern semifinals, but fell to the Grimsby Peach Kings, who went on to win the league championship four games to none in the East Finals. The Lady Hamilton Wildcats finished their first season of play with a 3-5 record and ended up in fourth place on the OAFL ladder. Making it into the playoffs, the team breezed past Etobicoke and Ottawa in the playoffs to make it to the grand final. The women gave it a go, but were eventually defeated in the final by the undefeated High Park Demons. The Mohawk Mountaineers won the OCAA Men's Basketball Championships in 2012. The championship was the first national basketball title for Mohawk since the 1971-72 season. The last time the college finished in the top three was 1998-99, when they won bronze. Mohawk finished the season with a 13-5 record and defeated Humber 89-86 in the OCAA Championship game. They previously split games with Humber in regular season play. The McMaster Marauders won the Yates Cup and the Mitchell Bowl in 2012. The team finished the 2012 regular season with a perfect 8-0 record and defeated Guelph 30-13 in the Yates Cup. They went on to defeat the Calgary Dinos 45-6 in the Mitchell Bowl in front of a hometown crowd. Quarterback Kyle Quinlan had 2,457 yards during the regular season, averaging 307.1 yards per game and 19 touchdowns. Hamilton's Melissa Tancredi was part of the bronze medal women's soccer team at the London 2012 Olympic Games. Tancredi played in all six games at the Olympics and tied for third most goals scored in the tournament with four goals, including two goals versus Sweden and the game-tying goal late in that match. Hamilton's born and raised distance runner Reed Coulsayet participated locally in the Around the Bay Road Race on March 25th of this year. Not only did Reed run the race, but he also won. Reed ran an impressive 1 hour, 33 minutes, and 20 seconds in a 30-kilometer race, just shy of the record set in 2010. Reed hopes to run the race again in 2013. Ann Caster, Summer Mortimer brought home four medals at the London 2012 Paralympic Games this summer. The athlete, who also previously competed in trampoline, won gold in the women's 100-meter backstroke S10, the women's 50-meter freestyle S10, won a silver medal in women's 200-meter individual medley SM10, and took home bronze in the women's 100-meter freestyle S10 event. Summer took home more hardware than any other Canadian athlete at either London Games.